Hi, this is Frid from the Jive Syntax and English in Color. I've had a cold, so my voice is still funny and I'm still, um, I often still have to cough, so bear with me. But I wanted to make a video. It's been quite a while since I was online. Someone sent me a joke via WhatsApp. Um, the joke is a photo with four words on it. And I'm going to sh share that with you in a minute because it's interesting. Um, because it actually highlights the difference between noun phrases and short two word sentences. Um, differences with regard to intonation and stress. So I'll show you what I mean by sharing my screen. Here we go. Oops, there we go. Okay, so pronunciation patterns in IPA reading practice. This was the photo that I was sent. And we can see there are two very happy kids who got some gifts and dad had to pay for it. And the dog wanted to chime in as well. Okay, so let's jump to the IPA version of these words and sentences. As you can see, these are two noun phrases and these are two short sentences. And when we look at the picture or the photo, we think that <clears throat> they, they are the same somehow. And of course it's funny, but pronunciation wise, they're not the same. Okay, um, an iPod is an object and the stress is on the first syllable, iPod. And for British English, it's iPod. Okay, then of course, some people buy iPads, iPod iPad. Um, both words are nouns. Both consist of two syllables and they both have the stress on the first syllable <clears throat> and no stress on the second syllable. Now when dad holds up a piece of paper that says, well I paid for this, I paid, regular pronunciation would be I paid. Whenever we use pronouns, um, pronouns refer to given information and so they tend to be less stressed than less stressed than the rest of the sentence. Um, so when we say Tom paid for this, Tom paid for this and Tom gets more stressed than when I'm talking and I say well by the way I paid for that unless I want to really totally stress this and then I would say and I paid but usually I would say, I paid, I paid. So we have two options here. Either we have stress, full stress on the second syllable, or we have um, stress on each word. And so notice in iPad, we have an iPod, we have one word each consisting of two syllables. In I paid, we have a sentence consisting of two words. Each word has one syllable. And in regular pronunciation, the second word receives more stress, I paid. Or they both receive stress when we want to emphasize things. And I paid. And then the dog says, I peed. We have the same thing. We have a sentence consisting of two monosyllabic words. And in some variations, we would only stress the verb, I peed. And, in, and if we want to stress both, the fact that I did the peeing and that I peed, I would say, I peed. Okay, and that sounds quite different from iPod and iPad. So again, iPod, iPad, I paid. I peed. I hope you enjoyed this and I will see you in the next video. Oh, and by the way, if you like this, give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends. Thank you. Bye.